I am Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question from my subscriber and I hope its solution helps you to learn about collinear points and its link with area of triangle. The question here is given the points A minus K plus 1 2K, B K 2 minus 2K and C minus 4 minus K 6 minus 2K. Find the value of K for the points to be collinear using area of triangle formula area equals to half x1 times y2 minus y3 plus x2 times y3 minus y1 plus x3 times y1 minus y2. Now this is a very important area of the triangle formula which you should remember with this question I have given you the formula it may not be given as an exercise for you okay now we'll use this formula I've also included derivation of this formula link on this video will take you to the derivation now if the points are collinear that means the area should be zero right so if I have three points which are along the same line in that case area should be zero right height is zero of this triangle so that concept is used to solve this particular question. So that means that this area, let's substitute the values of x1, y1, y2, y3 and calculate k. So here the values are x1, y1, x2, y2 and this is x3, y3, correct? So we can write area as equal to half of x1 is minus k plus 1 times y2 minus y3 which is 2 minus 2k this is y2 will do minus 6 plus 2k I am changing the signs as I am writing x2 is k times y3 minus y1 that is 6 minus 2k minus 2k plus x3 which is let me write here plus minus 4 minus k times y1 minus y2 that is 2k minus 2 plus 2k right so that becomes the area now let's and this area should be equal to 0 so so half we can multiply 2 by each side so that gets over we can simplify the inside terms now so we get minus k plus 1 times 2 minus 6 is minus 4 minus 2k plus 2k is 0 plus k times 6 minus 4k plus here we have minus 4 minus k times 4k minus 2 equals to 0. Let's open the bracket now. So minus and minus makes it plus 4k minus 4. Here we get plus 6k minus 4k square. Then minus 4 times 4 is 16k. Minus 4 times minus 2 gives us plus 8. Minus k times 4k minus 4k square and minus k times minus 2 gives us plus 2k equals to 0. Let's combine the like terms now. So, so we get, let's count uh, the uh, k squares first. So, we'll go in order. We'll take higher powers first. We'll take k squares first. So, that gives us minus 8k square. Now, let's count k's. So we have 4k plus 6k which is 10k. 10 minus 16 means minus 6k minus 6k plus 2k will give us minus 4k. right? So we get minus 4k now. The constants minus 4 plus 8 is plus 4 equals to 0. You can divide by minus 4 simplify this. So we get uh, 2k square plus we are dividing by minus 4 so we get plus k minus 1 equal to 0 right 
So that is a quadratic equation. Product is minus 2, sum is plus k. So we can factor this. So we get 2k square uh, plus 2k minus k minus 1 equals to 0. 2k is common. So we get k minus 1, I mean k plus 1, minus k plus 1 equals to 0. Uh, let's take it to the right side and then we'll solve it further. k plus 1 is common and we get 2k minus 1, 2k minus 1 equals to 0. Now that means there are two possible values of k. One is k plus 1 equals to 0. That gives us k equals to minus 1. The other one is 2k minus 1 equals to 0, which gives k equals to half, correct? So we have two solutions for uh, the given equation. Our solutions are k is equals to minus 1 or half, correct? So that is how you can solve it. So I'd like you to go through this video once again, try to understand how to solve such a question. Here is a very important formula to make a note of. I hope you understand and appreciate it. Feel free to write your comments. And if you like and subscribe my videos, that'd be great. Thank you. And all the best.